today I'm going to cook the famous borscht, or as we can call it in our country, borscht rosh. So I've done a little bit of research about this recipe. Some people say it's from Ukraine, from Russia. Some people mix it with meat or vegetables. Today I am going to make it with meat, so let's get started! For this recipe you will need a bunch of fresh parsley and dill, one tablespoon of tomato paste, two tablespoons of beef flavoring, one teaspoon of salt, a lemon, a bay leaf, three carrots, five celery stalks, two bell peppers, four small beets, one large onion, three small potatoes, one liter of beef broth, and one pound of meat chunks. To begin my borscht, I am going to prepare my meat and cut it in chunks. Grab a kettle! Add the meat into a 5.5 liter kettle. Fill the kettle with 4 liters of water. Place it on the stove on medium heat and add the bay leaf as well as the salt. Stir in those ingredients and cover the kettle to let it boil until the meat becomes tender. Now we're gonna start chopping! First comes the onion. Next comes the celery. Peel the carrots. Then cut off the ends and shred them. Ta-da! Next, cut the potatoes into cubes. Last but not least, the beans. the broth into the kettle. Then add the onions, celery, and the potatoes. Next, place a frying pan on the stove on medium heat. Add oil, the shredded beets, the carrots, the tomato paste, and saute them for 15 minutes. Cut your lemon in half and juice it. Chop up your dill and parsley. Add the sauteed mixture, beef flavoring, and lemon juice into the kettle. Stir in these ingredients. Then cover with a lid and lower the heat and let simmer for about 20 minutes. Then remove the lid and add in the fresh herbs. Then turn off the stove and let it rest for 10 minutes before serving. Enjoy with a dollop of sour cream or garlic toast. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please make sure to subscribe to my channel right here. Give me a thumbs up. Right here, make sure to see my previous videos. Bye.